after last week we, we had a definitely an improved performance and I think we can build on that and um, we just got to go out there and show Central Coast that this is our fortress and, uh, and basically win the game. It's a derby and I mean if you're not ready then you shouldn't be out there. Yeah, I suppose this one could go one or two ways. There's been a lot of commentary saying that the side perhaps doesn't have the confidence that it that needs, but uh, how confident would it make you if you can uh, get one up over the Central Coast here? Oh, definitely. I think after last last week's game, um, the, the team around and team confidence, um, it, it wasn't our best game ever, but um, from the week before and the, the game before that, I thought it was a much improved performance. And I think that's sort of the team that we are and we've just got to build on that and, and bring out our game a bit more and this week I think if we do that then I mean if we get a goal or two and um, the fans are behind us I think we could definitely go on to win the game. Um, a lot of the attention last season was on the back line and getting it right and a lot of the attention this time is on the, on the front line. How do you, how do you see the, the back line? Uh, do you feel a lot more comfortable? Yeah definitely I think with Q and I mean Scott Neville has already had a, a great few games so far and I think um, Building off that, I thought my, my last game was a bit better and I think together we, we feel quite strong and um, I mean we attack as a team and we defend as a team so it's not just us, it's the people in front of us and I mean also attacking as a team, um, scoring goals is not just the strikers, it's also the people around them and if we, we all get better as a team then I think um, we should do alright. What's the vibe like getting a meal back this weekend? Oh, I mean he's a... He's a seasoned professional and to have him around the team, uh, it's a great thing and um, yeah, if he plays this weekend then it should be a big boost for the boys and hopefully um, maybe he scores or sets up or something like that. And uh, what was the, the info like out in the pitch? Uh, does it appear he's come through the training session okay? Yeah, he looks alright. He looks quite comfortable out there so we'll see what happens um, from today to tomorrow and uh, yeah, we'll see, see if he's in the starting team or what's going on. Connor, there's been a lot made of the fact that you guys haven't scored a goal this year. Do you think a bit more should be made of the fact that you haven't conceded any for a couple of weeks? I think that's always going to happen. Um, last year we scored a lot of goals and we didn't, and we conceded a lot of goals, so the, the attacking side didn't get much credit. But this year it's sort of the, the other way around, and um, I think we've worked hard as a team. And obviously it's nice to not concede goals, but the main thing is to win, and we haven't done that yet. And hopefully this weekend we can.